New developments to reports in the seas off Gaza. CNN reporter Carl Penhall is aboard a boat, a ship called the Dignity that was approaching Gaza with an intention to deliver medical supplies. There has been a, a contact with an Israeli Navy boat. We understand Carl Penhall is on the line. Carl, what can you tell us? Hugh, uh, the Dignity is a 60-foot uh, motor vessel. It is transporting approximately three tons of medical and humanitarian aid with the intention of taking it towards Gaza. Aboard the ship also are um, members of the international community, including doctors and surgeons who are going to take that international aid. Uh, the boat, though, while still in international waters, has been rammed by Israeli patrol boats. The boat, our vessel, has been damaged. There has been some damage to a roof section and to uh, glass windows around the uh, steering uh, area. And uh, the captain says that uh, the vessel is taking on a small amount of water. That at this stage is not life-threatening, but the ship was very severely rammed uh, by one of those Israeli patrol boats. Those patrol boats have been following the vessel for the half hour prior to the ramming incident, Hugh. How was this boat, this vessel, the Dignity, flagged? What flag was it carrying? And how absolutely certain can you be this was an Israeli vessel uh, that rammed it? Uh, the uh, Dignity is a Gibraltar-flagged vessel. Uh, the boats uh, were high-speed, relatively high-speed boats that had been following the Dignity for the previous half hour. They rammed the vessel without warning, but after the after the ramming, there was a radio message, the captain tells me, saying that the Israeli patrol boat uh, was accusing the Dignity of being involved in terrorist activities.